<laughs> Sorry. All right. No, so you're good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I wanted to like kind of talk to you about like what we, uh, you know, I ran into you the other day, and I was mm -hmm. hoping you'd be around. Um, so basically, like I said the other day, um, the farm back here. Well, I don't know if you know who Wayne Biggs is, but I don't. But I'm baby, so you know. Okay. Yeah, he's uh kind of like the grandfather of the weed game, um, and I would kind of be his young prince <laughs> if there was like a hierarchy i don't know like let's put it this way we've been doing this shit since the fucking Wii game started and like this uh farm back here the reason why there's a gate on it and it's closed and locked up um uh, we used to run a dispensary called green beans we used to sell uh mm -hmm. seeds to the city to other people that want to fucking learn how to grow weed whatever if they want to fucking get into it legally or uh, otherwise whatever <clears throat> you know you hit us mm -hmm. up and we fucking this is our farm this is where we grow it all and fucking pump the seeds out to people um well business doesn't exist anymore but the farm does and uh like i told you the other day every now and then i uh i do come up here and i do use it um I, it's a, sort of a get in get out situation for me you know it's, it's kind of gray area i would uh i don't know uh listen i don't know what you guys do i don't know anything about like chaos but i've heard about it people have told me about it um at the end of the day um Listen, I'm not trying to stomp all over what the hell you guys are doing. We just use this farm every now and then. So, um, I have, I have a grow I have to do today. And I would like to use the farm and I'm coming here kind of out of respect. Just to let you, mm -hmm. you know that, uh, you know, that's my intention today. And, uh, yeah. that's, that's it. You know, I'm a ghost. I come in, I sneak in the top, I do my thing, I leave, no one sees me. I've never been caught here. Um, since it's not a business anymore, it is illegal, obviously. Um, mm -hmm. So that's kind of the key component here, you know? And uh, listen, out of respect, like I said, um, I would prefer to have this be as harmonious as possible. And as a thank you for uh, the discretion, I'm happy to provide a little bit of wheat, you know, high quality wheat, like almost max rep weed if that okay you know interests you at all i'm talking you know 240 bucks per bag type of weed you know not not the doo-doo you know if that mm -hmm. makes sense so yeah no absolutely um i so i'm a member which means that i can't make any decisions on anything um i did pass this up to the vp let him know what you were doing mm -hmm. um i know we're having a meeting on monday and mm -hmm. this will definitely get brought up um, I'm going to be honest, I don't think you're going to see any pushback from us on this. Um, because, you know, you're, you're in and out and there's no issue with that, right? Yes, and I am also willing to break a little bit of bread in the process. So I think that's an important little detail to let the homies know. Um, yeah, absolutely. So, um, the only thing is just the discretion that I spoke of. Because here's the deal, there are people that know about this place and they do try to sneak in every now and then. And I've had to mm -hmm. shoo them away violently um so uh the block specifically they do know about this spot. okay um yeah there's a dude named brick block that i had to send away and then there's a few other people over the years um because this has been around for about two years now um mm -hmm. who i've had to well they've taken some swims um against their will but you know we try to avoid that when we can so um the fact is i have 20 plants i need to put down and uh i'm look i'm gonna i'm gonna ask i'm gonna do the thing where you do it and then ask for forgiveness later you know if your boys are heated yeah. about it i'm gonna lay them against the wall basically so it's very very hard to see them through the front gates um so if anyone you know cruises through they probably ain't gonna see shit you feel me okay yeah right. no absolutely um i'm gonna i'm gonna tell you that like no opposition for me today you can go for it and like i said i don't think you're gonna have any issue with us saying don't do it obviously um but like i said i'll get back like i will take that oh. too perfect thank mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. um i'll get back to you probably i'll probably shoot you uh, maybe i'll call you on tuesday it's probably when i'll be around if i'm not you can send me a text whatever i'm always mm -hmm. reachable um i'm always you know especially during these hours too if you are if you're around these hours i will be down in little soul 
Um, I run a bong shop out of Little Soul, and uh, okay, feel free to swing by. Obviously, mm. yeah, I'm uh, I'm kind of trying to expand into NA, so that's kind of yes where I um, thrive, I guess, in this uh, situation. So okay. I'm probably going to be the person you talk to if you're only around in NA. Okay, okay. Um, obviously, if you're being a bit of a DJ and you're hanging around AU, I'll sneak. I'll sneak um, into those hours. Yes, you'll see me mm-hmm. during those too. Okay, so that's when you're going to see, you know, the leaders and that kind of okay, thing. So cool. if ever you want a meeting, that would be kind of when. Do you um, have a name for, like, any of the people that are in the, like, I mean, unless you, you don't have to reveal it to me, but I'm, I'm just curious. Like, I might know some of these people. I'm not sure. Mm-hmm. Uh, so Frankie Fitch is our president. Frankie Fitch. Okay. And Mike Frost would be our VP. I feel like I know the name Frankie, but okay. Yeah, I'll have to just kind of have an interface and stuff. Um, so mm-hmm. Absolutely. All right. Well, listen, as far as this... All, you know, all the other structures around here, I have no business with them. Um, I hope you guys can get, you know, if you guys are, you know, going to hold down this area, I hope you guys can get something, you know, going over here because it's kind of a dead part of the city. Um, mm-hmm. So, I mean, yeah. yeah. Well, that's the goal. Uh, we've got, you know, this village here, and then we were also taking grapeseed. Uh, we got a hub proposal in, so Ooh. hopefully we'll see the area kind of booming. Yeah, yeah. That'd be um, sick. And we're going to try and keep business over there and, you know, pleasure okay. over here. It hasn't of. boomed in a while, not since fishing was down at the docks, to be honest. God, yeah, I yeah. I miss those days. This was actually yeah. my favorite fishing spot to go to. So yeah. it's kind of ironic that we're here now. <laughs> cool. Well, uh, yeah, I hope yep. it works out on that level. But, mm-hmm. I mean, until then, you know, hanging is the first part of the process. So there you go. Yep, absolutely. Um, so, yeah, like I said, no issue today. Um, right. Around AU, we can probably just, like, keep an eye on it for you. Well, you know, we're here in the that's area why, anyways. And that's the thing. That's why I'm willing. Like, if, you, if listen, the moment I ran into you, I saw a business opportunity. So it's entirely possible that if there's some level of, like, security up here, like, dude, I have no problem bouncing some fucking weed off you guys and making you guys. And look, if you do a weed run with my shit and you have good uh, sell rep, you'll make 50 racks a run, you know? I mean, okay. pretty fucking serious money. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So, yeah, absolutely. I'm just saying, you know, that's uh, mm-hmm. that's on the table. I have a lot of deals with different people in the city, but um, nobody has the luxury of really uh, knowing where I grow. So you guys having that off the rip would be, uh, you know, something that would kind of make a relationship very, very mutually beneficial if you catch my drift. Mm-hmm. So. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Um, so, yeah, that's... Well, I'm definitely going to pass it along. Okay. Um, like I said, I'm not seeing many issues with it. Um, just the quick conversations we had before our big meeting. Yeah. Um, it seemed like there was going to be no opposition. I'm not trying um, to big dick, you know, let your boys know. Yeah, no, absolutely. So. Yeah, no, I, that's like I told them that it was really respectful. The meeting we had last time and I'll mention it was this one as well. You didn't and tell yeah. them that I did a backflip when I reversed away from you, did you? I didn't say anything about it. Don't okay. you worry. <clears throat> okay. Marcel, you didn't yeah. hear that. <clears throat> oh, all right. Put your mouth, Marcel. Put the tongue, no, back, in your mouth. Put the tongue back in your mouth. All right. Yeah. Um, well, with that being said, the quicker I get this in the ground, the mm-hmm. better. Um, I, uh, I'm i going to get started and uh, try to keep it as discreet as possible. I'm only going to be up here to water and harvest, and um, it'll just be speckled throughout the night. And you might see me, you might not. Um, I think next time I come up here, I'll probably be... A little bit more camouflage. Um, I thought well, there was going to be snow on the ground. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So. Um, me personally, I'm on the way to bed, so okay. you will not see me at all. Okay. Um, yeah, you shouldn't have any issues because not a lot of people come around here these days. So. Okay. All right. All right. Cool. You're good. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you so much. Uh, thanks for hearing me out. And, uh, well, I'm going to go get started. And, uh, you know, I'm sure you guys will be smoking mm-hmm. on something good soon. <laughs> have a good one. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, enjoy. Good meeting. Yep. Good meeting. Let's go. Let's go. There it is, business! I told you guys that there would be a good business opportunity! Now, because I went to bed, I fucking don't have coffee. I don't have coffee anymore. Here. That's why I carry two. You beast. This weather's crazy. The audio's still (laughs) doing it, but not as bad now, chat. So I'm, uh, that's a dub for us. I know the Frankie Fitch name. Good name, bad name. Um, I mean, I don't have any really like personal relation to him. I know Merc wanted to kill him at one point. I don't know why. Mm-hmm. 
Okay, Mark's not really affiliated with us anymore, so... Okay. Yeah, that's the, only, that's the only thing I know about him. I don't really know much, much about him further. I forgot what he did. Okay. All right. Uh, this could be good. This could be good. I mean, the fact that, I just really, to mention the it fact that uh, you don't remember that much is actually kind of a good thing, because, like, right? Like, yeah, I just wanted to mention it, because, I mean, it, maybe he was a troublemaker. I don't know exactly what right, the uh, right, context right. was. All right, so do me a favor. Um, while I'm planting, you can kill two birds with one stone for us. There's two water buckets. Yeah, quick? there's two of them oh. right there. And then uh, I'll do this, and uh, we can both water and just get out of here as soon as possible. Yeah, she seems pretty cool, man. Honestly, she didn't have to be as kind as she was about it. And uh, I might need you soon, by the way, to start a boost. So I would, uh, uh, let me uh, get on radio, yeah. They're good right now, but just don't do any boosts just in case they want you to start with. I'm on my way. Let me get back in the queue. So audio still does it when we go on the laptop, which it always does, but it's not doing it just passively like it was anymore. It was like passively just wigging out, bro. It was so bad. God damn it, I gotta leave and get back in. Uh, I mean, they seem chill. Like, at least she did. Like, no problems whatsoever. Bro, I kind of fuck with her. She's, you know, look, yeah, people that are willing to, like, have a conversation, you know, and they could be, you know, little tough guys, um, you know. I was willing to work with that shit. Bro, it's just like how you talk to people, too. It's yeah, like a big piece yeah. of it. She wasn't trying to be like fucking sassy. You know, sometimes, bro, you know, these people get like some sort of cut or like a fucking mask or like some sort of like bandana and they just like think it empowers them to be a fucking freak. They start acting up. Yeah, they start acting up. She's chilling. Like when, uh, when Maggie was rolling around with us late at night. Yeah. These dudes might just be big stoners. Uh, I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. Maybe underneath us. We're fine. I think it's right here, underneath. Oh, I man. think this is it. If there were cops, oh, up, bro, they wouldn't come up here. Sirens. Please. Yeah, they would be. They would pounce. You're right. I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna go to pack seats. Uh, they like I applied for like a concert creator badge like a long time ago, and I got she got approved. So I'm trying to figure out if I want to go or not. Ooh. You ever been to East? What is it? Pax East? I've heard about this shit, but like I don't I've never been to PAX. Uh yeah, Mike Block. Oh fuck, me they're on me. Like, we are gonna have an easy boost for really good, but uh, I've never been uh, I've never been to Boston actually. Me neither. Really? I've been everywhere, but you. like not there. <laughs> yeah, I did a robbery of the Littlemans off. yesterday. I guess they want me for that. What? You ever been to Mass at all? Actually, nope. Okay, I heard it's just like a mini New York. Yeah, it's just like unknown to me, man. Unknown territory. New York. What's your favorite spot in America? I guess to visit. For like mm, a I like Seattle a lot. I don't really like cold weather, but Se I like Seattle and Denver. They're both really nice. Oh, you're going to have fun in Colorado, but yeah, okay, like, might be coming. Denver is one of those places where like if it if it's cold there, I actually don't mind it because it's like very like it's like dry too. So it's like powdery. The blue lights? It's not like a fucking yeah, yeah. wet mess. Seattle's a wet mess, but like oh, they all did, if you're in the city, not. it's pretty it's tight. Not. You heard uh, K might be coming. That'd be tight. It'd be tight, honestly. Just considering. It'd be tight to just touch you know, as well. Have a bunch of boys around. You know? Hold on. Yeah, just chill out, you know. Get some hours in before we all go, because uh, we're going to need to hit. We're gonna, we're, I don't know how long you're planning on being out there. I guess it depends Bro, on whatever stop. we all do, but. We'll just see what happens. I'm very. Just don't leave a day into the thing again, bro, please. Nah, it's different if it's like a low key thing and it's like the boys. The boys. The brothers? The boys. The boys. Yeah, we uh, doing over here, fellas. Oh. Big chillin'. Radio's been pretty tame today, it hasn't been crazy. But we also so, don't have like, uh, It shouldn't run a, a rent run here in the next hour. Say again? It's interesting running a meth run in the next hour. Oh, shit. Probably take the, uh, the main boys if they want to. If there's space, but uh, I know the main crew are in. Trying to form a uh, group for Charles and I. Let's just say we got some rival competitors that are trying to get in. The uh, the next run's available in about a little less than an hour, so I want to show up there ten minutes prior. 
Make sure these motherfuckers know that uh, who is it? Who this. is it? Uh, you'd probably have to, have to, or you'd have to ask Charles for that. I don't know, to be honest. Come on, Charles. Any, any of the names or anything? I have no idea. She, no. I actually can't drive. I'm like, oh, I'm out. I'm out. Boy, spots. So I mean, uh, be happy to have you guys. You know, uh, just let me know. But yeah, I'm, I'm really, uh, I'd love to run this. So. You still have water in those? Uh, yeah. All right. Hell yeah. That's why I was like, I thought, I, I didn't think I would, was going to. The fucking local boat smashing against something out there. Uh, uh -huh. Sonny, how much time do you say left on it? I think we got a little an hour, Mr. K. Probably around like 45, 50 minutes. I could check next time I got my dongle in my hand, but, uh. I'm in an A&W right now, and the last time I pulled my dongle load, uh, they didn't let the me back in for uh, a couple years. Got into a messy coy case, and I'm trying to avoid that, you know? It's gonna be a great girl, I hope. I really do. Yeah. A All quick right. weed run hey, while, we, uh, while we while we wait in here, but yeah, I mean, uh, Charles ready. and I have been antsy to run this shit. I'll be, uh, I'll have enough cooked my own stuff, uh, probably within the next day or two. Right. 